Hello, everyone! Today we are going to make the arms of the strawberry cow. We will be using red and white yarns. Start by wrapping the yarn around. Wrap it clockwise around the pinky finger, then counterclockwise around the index finger, and counterclockwise again around the middle finger. Hold the junction with your thumb. Next, we're going to create a magic loop inside this loop. Crocheting a magic ring can be challenging. Beginners can refer to our detailed tutorial video for basic instructions. First, start crocheting the first round by making a slip knot. Insert the crochet hook into the loop. Grab the yarn and pull it through. Flip the crochet hook with the tip facing towards you. Then yarn over below and behind and pull through. We have completed a slip knot. Now, in this magic loop, we need to crochet six single crochets. To learn how to crochet a single crochet, beginners can refer to our basic tutorial for detailed instructions. Let me explain it in detail here. Insert the crochet hook into the magic loop. Yarn over from the top and behind the yarn and wrap the yarn and pull through the loop. Now we have to loops on hook. Then yarn over from below behind and pull through both loops at once. Great! We have completed the first single crochet. Mark it with a stitch marker. Let me demonstrate it again. Insert the crochet hook into the magic loop. Yarn over from the top and behind the yarn and pull through the loop. Now we have to loops on hook. Then yarn over from below behind and pull through both loops at once. Note that when pulling through the loops, the crochet hook should be pointing down, making it easier to pull through the loops. Fantastic! The second single crochet is done. This is the third single crochet. Four. Five. Six. Remove the piece from middle finger. Pull this yarn tail tight and form a circle. Finally, Remove the stitch marker. Insert the crochet hook at the spot where the stitch marker was and make a slip stitch. Pull the loop tightly to conceal the last stitch formed when making a slip stitch. As this stitch is not included in the crochet round, great, our magic ring is complete. Yes, round one is complete. Now let's move on to the second round. We need to crochet a single crochet increase in each stitch six increases in total start with a chain stitch and then make an increase in the first stitch hole single crochet number one mark it with stitch markers single crochet number two okay the first increase finished then move on to the next stitch to make increase again. Okay, the second increase finished, then the third increase in the next stitch. Please complete the rest on your own and make slip stitch to complete this round. Okay, let's move on to crochet round three. Start by making a chain stitch and then make a single crochet in each stitch, 12 single crochets in total. This is the first single crochet. The second one, the third one. Please pause here and complete the remaining single crochet stitches on your own. 
Okay, let's move on to crochet round four. Start by making a chain stitch. In this round, we are going to make three sets. Each set consists of two single crochets and a decrease. Let's make the first set. Make a single crochet in each of the first two stitches. This is the first one. And the second one. In the next two stitches, we will make a decrease. Alright, our first set is complete. Let me show you again. One single crochet. One single crochet again. And then a decrease. Then the third set. At last, remove the stitch marker and make slip stitch to finish this round. Great, round four is complete. Now, let's start crocheting the round five. We will switch from the red yarn to the white yarn. Take off the red yarn and warp the white yarn. Secure the end of the white yarn between your middle finger and ring finger. Place the crochet hook above the white yarn, yarn over and pull through the red yarn on hook. Pull the tail of the red yarn and the white yarn tight. Then we continue crocheting. In this round, we are going to make a single crochet in each stitch, nine single crochets in total. The first single crochet. Note that the white and red yarn tails should be placed above the crochet hook. Then finish the single crochet. Then the second and the third single crochet. Now we can cut off the red yarn and hide both yarn tails inside the piece. Then continue crocheting the single crochet stitch. Please finish it on your own. The crochet method for round six to eight is the same. You will crochet one single crochet stitch in each stitch. Please finish it on your own. Because the piece is relatively small, it is recommended to fold it while crocheting to make it easier. Once we finish crocheting the arm, we can add some stuffing inside to make it fuller and more comfortable to use. We don't need to stuff too much. All right, we continue by making a chain stitch. Then we stack the two sided pieces together and crochet for single crochets.
Once we finish crocheting, we leave a slightly longer tail of yarn and cut it off. Fasten off. All right, our arm is now fully crocheted. The same crochet method applies to the other arm. Please complete it on your own. If you have any problems during crocheting, please feel free to contact us via email. We will reply to you as soon as we receive it.